Okay, hi, I'm Matthew Sutting. Matthew's channel, my life and screen. So today I'm gonna to be talking to you about my second project, the Continuity Oral. With this, I found that there's a lot more to continuity than just like what you always hear about, which is basically, oh, someone's wearing a watch in a period movie, or the hair's like this in one thing, and then the hair's like that. We had a list of like 25 options of various aspects of continuity in film, and my topic was sets and location continuity. Initially, I thought, oh, this will be very interesting. So at first, I was like, what the f foodly do am I going to talk about sets and location continuity like you just need to make sure it's the same but like it's a set like there's not much it can change but then I realized this is really example based TV shows would be a good thing to do because they often use the same set so if a set changes or if geographically it doesn't make sense I mean that's also another aspect of set and location continuity that I didn't think about at first yeah so I thought maybe TV but then TV I realized I probably have to watch about an entire run of a set Series, which could be up to like 200 episodes it told me when you're researching film it can take a lot more time than researching other things because you can't skim through a film to find what you want you have to literally watch the whole movie or watch the whole TV series so luckily being a big fan of the Scream movies I realized Scream and Scream 4 hello I watched the two movies I made my whole argument and then I presented my oral what I realized three minutes is not long <laughs> it was very distracting because I was lecturer had this timer set and it would go off when your three minutes was up and like if you kept going I mean it was just very frustrating I was only fourth so I didn't realize what it was when I did mine and then after I finished I was like oh wait whoopsie I learned that three minutes is not a long time you need to be concise I did put a lot of work into it but in terms of testing my RO I didn't put a lot of work into it you really need to test you need to make sure that you've got all the important information in there I suppose it's a good lesson also in making movies you need to make sure you've got the important stuff when it comes to cutting things down because there will be times where you'll be told to cut stuff down another thing was I learned that um, I mean, no, I think I'm actually done here. Anyway.